is your look alike after a um, dress? <laughs> you think about this activity, what did you learn about your friends? I learned out that my friends are great. <laughs> speaker for this afternoon is an international consultant and lecturer in the field of stress management. Team speaker for the, this afternoon, Dr. Aydelin Season. Thank you, Dr. Idol Yurong, for introducing me to this young and uh, quite young group of people. And seeing them beautiful as they are, I'm wondering now if uh, they have stresses too, because I'm clueless. It doesn't show. Uh, <laughs> it's, it's been a while since I left for the States <laughs> in the mid-70s. Uh, I'm amazed, truly amazed at the change I'm seeing. How Silliman Mission Hospital has grown to become the Silliman University Medical Center. Life happens, and you don't get a chance to eat the next few days' pancakes. And all pancakes start piling up. You try to eat, laughing without reason. <laughs> but uh, on the contrary, maybe they have more than their share of stresses. That's why they end up that way. Medical school doesn't exist in a bubble. One says medical school is perfectly manageable. If you get everything done that needs to be done every single day. But everybody knows, you know, that is never going to happen in med school. Stress is unpleasant, even when it is stretching. And you can change the fact that becoming a doctor is stress-inducing endeavor that requires long works and hard work. While it is not possible to take stress out of medical school, it is certainly possible to learn and use stress to relieve strategies that can help you handle it better. Relaxation techniques, meditation, contemplation can calm your mind. Laughter and humor are two powerful tools helping people cope and get through threatening situations. Discuss the circumstances you are facing with trusted friends and confidantes. Learn to delegate, leave time for yourself in your schedule, and learn how to say no to stress-inducing requests that are not essential. But needless to say, we are in the medical field, so we are trained to handle stress. For me, one of the main ways to handle stress the stress of medical life, the stress of always thinking correctly, very intellectual, is to do something so totally not very intellectual. In the medical field, you have to be careful with instructions. You have to follow instructions. One will be group Betty, and then group two will be group Popeye, and then group three will be group one. Okay, so when I say Betty, you will say, Boop, boop, they do with hip action. <laughs> because the facilitators are watching you. It's a Tomasa, you will go on stage.
broken in the action.